what is the ideal of Valentine's Day date outfit? Probably a night. I see you too, Hey guys, and welcome back to my channel. Currently in the library, so can't do the exciting intro like I normally would. I'm so greasy, but it's because of the oil I put on my face to help with the dryness and this weather. But, anyways, today is Valentine's Day. So, happy Valentine's Day to all you guys that actually celebrate Valentine's Day. Um, I'm in the library because I have an exam at 12. It's going to be 10.51. I just finished my first class. So I have like one hour. I already studied and everything. So I'm just like going over, making sure I do everything and going through everything. And then afterwards, I think I want to make this covered strawberry because I always wanted some for Valentine's Day. So oh, that's what I want to do. And you guys come along with me on this totally i'm sad because i like i didn't i remember how to do one question like when the time was already up and he was giving us like a few extra time just to like finish up because he realized like a lot of us were still working and i forget like i knew how to do the question last night i knew how to do it this morning i knew how to do the question right and i did not think of it like that. i don't even know what i'm talking about all of that to say I'm mad, but yeah, I say I really just mess up like that. But anyways, you know that happens from time to time. Hold on, I gotta fix my jacket. Yeah, I literally mess my own self, and I'm like crazy mad because I'm like yo. I know how to do this like I really knew oh my gosh well anyways I can't cry over spoiled milk or spilled milk whatever the saying is so now I'll just check myself up literally go to the store for real and get the strawberries and make my chocolate covered strawberries as I wanted to do so yeah I'll bring you guys on a journey with me for, for now as always I forgot my gloves so I'll try to get as much footage as I can until I reach home. I could stay like this forever following you. Just don't get too far And I'll be right where you are You're a dream that I could find Now, I'm just gonna make my way over Ooh, I already see the strawberries Okay, I made it But I don't want them tiny. Let's just look for the chocolate now and get out of here. I successfully reached the snack. I never tried. Oh, I guess he's the knockoff Oreos, Mr. Creamy. Anyways, y'all be so proud I eat Oreos in a while since I've been working out. I haven't bought Oreos probably two weeks. But this feels like a while to me because I used to eat Oreos feel like every week but probably not that much but yeah oh, I could buy noodles I needed some ramen 
can't even see the type I want. Anyways, I'm looking for the child. I'm in the right aisle. As you guys can see, the right aisle. But yeah, so y'all know my favorite chocolate is dairy milk. So I think I'm gonna get this one. This is what it is. It's full bar tablets. Oh, if not, I'm a the destiny option. Because everything else is smaller bit. This is my favorite chocolate actually. This word. I wish it was long like this or something. This would have been good, but I guess I'll do this one instead. But it's just for a bars. I want it to be bigger than this. I want it to be bigger than this. But I'm quite sure this could work. I'll just try it with this. I was looking for the, like, the huge, huge pack, but I don't see it. So I guess this is the bigger, biggest pack. Yeah. home as you guys can see wash the strawberries I've already cut up the chocolate basically they're like chocolate bars and then you know how they come like separate like this so I just cut them like this and then put them in the middle so right now I'm just waiting on the bowl I'm gonna use to dry I'm just waiting on the strawberries to dry because after I, like I said I already washed it and then I'm gonna start getting this process on the road so it probably will drive in the next two minutes I would say and then I'm gonna start getting the show on the road um, yeah I'll show you guys the strawberry and the chocolate I cut so far I don't have a brown cutting board so the white one is really messy okay so that's basically what I'm working with so yeah I use a huge pot because the other part I'm using it to cook yesterday anyways Tell me how you guys, Valentine's Day going so far. Yeah, I went to school, had an exam, it was the coldest day ever today. So that was that. That was all I did for Valentine's Day. Oh, and I took pictures with JJ. Nah, I never showed you guys who JJ was. So this is JJ. Just realized this is first Valentine's Day. Hi, JJ. He's not good with words yet, by the way, so. So you guys is good. Over here to this chocolate man. So I'm just, I just put the water on in this pot here. It's a huge pot. <laughs> like I said, um, the bowl is too small for the pot, but it still will work. I found a way like to place it without it falling in. So hopefully it stays like this. I'm just gonna wait until it boils a little bit or it begins to boil. Then I'll add the chocolate into the bowl, then you guys will see the mixture and the mixture. Anyways, guys, that was an epic, epic, epic fail. So, you know, I guess you guys could have seen that was going wrong from the beginning because, like I said, the pot was too big and me trying to be me, trying to make the impossible possible. Guess what happened? You guys know chocolate burn really quick, quickly. That's why I tell you, even if you're doing it, try not to like move away from the stove for longer than 10 seconds. But anyways, chocolate burns really quickly. So yeah, the bowl actually fell inside the pot and it instantly started to burn. And I was like trying my best to like <laughs> hurry up, pick it up. But of course the water was like kind of hot. So yeah, but me being me, you know, I still tried to save it, so <laughs> I got a little bit of chocolate 
that good amount of chocolate. Well, good. A little portion of the good chocolate that wasn't burned. It was very little of it. And I still tried to zoom, zoom, zoom. Whip that strawberry in it. But hey, so I guess that's two failures for today. So since... I don't think I'll show you guys it, but I'm quite sure I'm still gonna eat it. And I did put it in the freezer and everything to see if um, it was getting sad or whatever. So I'll check back up on it. I don't think I'll show you guys it because, like I said, it didn't even stick properly or anything like that. So I'm gonna do some Valentine's Day questions for you. If I could just end the video all like this. So the first question is, what is your favorite Valentine's Day treat? So I guess everyone, not I can't say everyone. Uh, that probably would be, that probably be my favorite chocolate or chocolate covered strawberries, of course. <laughs> yep, that's why I kind of did it today because I actually like them, but I don't actually um, buy them or anything. But I do like them. It's one of those kind of things. What was your favorite Valentine's Day memory? Hmm memory 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 i don't really have a lot of valentine's day memory because i really never did anything for valentine's day even when i was in a relationship or whether i was not but and i got my gift basket or whatever i guess that was a good memory it was a good memory i, I say i guess because i don't i can't remember like if i did anything that day to make it extra special or it's just the basket Oh, I think I it was yeah it was a good memory because I was surprised. That's why because I didn't expect anything and I always say don't get me anything. I always tell people that. So that's why it was a good memory. What celebrity would you not mind having as your Valentine? Celebrity Chris Brown, but not because I want to actually be my Valentine because I like I said in so much videos already. Me and him need to plan out our birthday bash because. As you may know or may not know, me and Chris Brown has the same birthday. So it would have to be Chris Brown just so I could get him to talk on talk to one on one and be like, yo, I've been trying to set this birthday up since I was like twelve. You know what I mean? I always tell people when I turn twenty one, you can have this big birthday bash. I be turned twenty one a year ago. So now when I'm twenty five, we have to do a bash. So yeah, it'd have to be Chris Brown, just so we could, you know, talk about the nitty gritties. <laughs> What is the ideal of Valentine's Day date outfit? Probably a nice dress with some heels for the photos just because I can't walk in heels. <laughs> and yeah, just like a nice dress, like a nice bodycon dress, you know? With some nice heels and a little bag and everything. Like I said, just for the photos because I can't walk in it and I don't like carry bag. So yeah, and then afterwards, put on my flats and then we go for dinner and chop it up from there. Last question. Who made us store-bought gifts? Hmm, I, I don't know. I'm a hopeless romantic. <laughs> uh, if it's a store gift, I would say who made gift because I feel like it's more meaningful and would be more personal to me versus something you go in the store is either roses or somebody already make the gift basket or, you know? Unless you're that type of guy that make you like make your own gift basket for your girlfriend or your wife or whatever, then that would be extra more sweet and extra better. For people just that buy random baskets or random gift sets or body sets or whatever, like I say, I would rather homemade just because it's more sentimental and it probably has more of me in it versus a typical every woman kind of thing. So I'd probably say homemade, like I say. It's more thought put into it, and I feel like it's more personal to me. So if you guys agree with me or not, comment down below. Let me know what you guys think about that. Like I said, starboard gift. It has to be something like I said I always wanted or that you really knew I wanted and you wait until Valentine's Day to get it for me. For me to be like, oh my gosh, like that was better than a homemade gift. Because like jewelry and stuff like that, like you know, they're all sweet, but it's kind of basic, you know, for Valentine's Day. So yeah, I think I'm going to end the video here. So thank you guys for watching today's video. You guys will get it today. So it's currently 4.11. So good afternoon, peeps. I'm going to see you guys in the next. Thank you for all my new subscribers who subscribed. I've been seeing y'all. I've been seeing y'all. I've been putting y'all comments, loving it, replying to it. So thank you guys for the support. I'll see each and every one of you in the next 
video bye i know i look so different with my hair pulled back hey who is this